Hey, this is MassX with a new One Punch Man The Strongest video. And we have our increased rates coming with Super Owl Dark Shine. Should you be pulling for him? Should you even be wasting those tickets? Let's talk about him. He's a grappler hero. Same road damage reduction, damage share. And his skills attacks a single target with two combo strikes for 120% attack damage and grants tenacity absorb damage equal to 10% of HP. His ultimate deals 130% attack damage to a target in a cross-shaped area. There's a 100% chance to inflict injury on the main target for two turns. When attacked, grants injury damage equal to 50% attack. Shares 40% of damage taken by two low HP alloy allies for two turns by sharing damage reduces damage taken by 20%. Cannot share damage when HP is below 20%. Let's talk about this character. Alrighty. He is a hell of a solid tank. He's actually really good in the zombie man meta that we currently have. You know, his shield, his ult, they generate energy using that Zombie Man core. So it's a no-brainer if you need a tank for your Zombie Man core team. If you have TTM and you have two other primaries that you use, okay, that are grapplers, then he's probably not necessary for you and not needed to get, okay? He doesn't need to use energy, which is a huge plus though for him. Um, and his passive helps to reduce ultimate damage for the same row. So that's cool too. So he's just a solid, solid character. And speaking of that passive, when battle begins, grants 40% ult damage reduction to everyone in the same row for two turns. When taking fatal damage for the first time each battle, it restores his HP equal to 30% of max HP, permanently increases HP by X, wherever it's at, blah, blah, blah. Point is, he's a really good grappler. And there are pluses to him and pluses to TTM. I've talked about this before in videos. You know, his basic attack, uh, you know, generates a shield. He has unyielding. He's just really good. But the big question is, should you pull for him? Well, if you already got a tank or you already have your three main grapplers, I would say this is a definite pass because things are gonna be changing the horizon. So, especially if you've already got TTM, I would probably not even bother with this, especially if you're free to play and you already are set with this. If you don't have Zombie Man and not using the core and you already have a grappler tank, then yeah, it's also, again, probably a hard skip. If you already have them and you're just looking to boost them up some more, go to town, have some fun with it. But at this point in time in the game, you know, they're really pushing quickly that this meta may be over sooner than in most the other types of this game that have gone on for longer. So it is a concern to overly invest in the Zombie Man meta right now because things are changing, which I, I will be talking about in further videos with knowing certain releases now that are coming, that it does make you rethink where you want to go. And if you are in a place where you're comfortable with the fact that you have Zombie Man and you have a team that you're comfortable with, it's probably time to start thinking about the future and not worry about getting stronger because you're going to need those grappler resources as I will talk about in a future video because it is going to be necessary for some of these characters, one in particular coming soon. So to me, this is a hard pass if you do, if you have a set team that you're using it's not necessary. Hey, if you're new to the game and it's early on, this is one of the best tanks out there. I mean, between him and TTM, you can't go wrong, you know? There are pluses and minuses to both of them. If you're looking for a more offensive mind tank, then of course it's always TTM. If you're looking for a true tank, then of course it's Super Alloy. 
Let me know if you're gonna pull on this banner or if you are conserving like me right now resources because you know what the future is going to be looking like because that is key. With that, as always, please like and subscribe. It helps so much. Take care and have a great day.